Welcome to the Resume Pro demonstration. In the next few minutes, you will see how easy it is for you and your patient to complete a test. Let's begin testing using the Resume Pro. The user can program accounts, perhaps one per type of disease, doctor, or study. What we have is one for adult, adult obstructed, and pediatric with different frequencies. I'm going to select adult for my patient, and it's gonna ask me to put in my password a new test. Here we have to enter in our patient information. All the normal info, as in spirometry, need to be entered for calculation of predicted normal values, such as age, height, weight, and gender. We're going to hit pre to begin testing and measuring our filter. We position our patient onto the mouthpiece with the neck at about a 90 degree angle, not under nor overstretched. Nose clip on and hands on the cheeks. We then select start test. When this test starts, the system adjusts the oscillation to the patient breathing, making it very comfortable for every patient type, from small children to large adults, and compliance to the ERS 2003 FOT guidelines, peak to peak mouth airways pressure. The counting of the breaths are accepted breaths. The algorithm automatically rejects bad breaths. So if my patient should happen to cough, <coughs> notice that the system stops counting until a coherent breath or a physiological value is found. Then it continues. We will stop when 10 accepted breaths are measured. Then we will stop the test. My patient can come off the mouthpiece. The first screen is obstructed qualification with the most important parameters, resistance and reactance at five hertz, inspiratory, expiratory, total volume with the predicted normals. The next screen is the resistance reactance graph at five, 11 and 19 hertz. I want to save my data, and the PDF report can be saved on a USB memory stick, or if a compatible printer is connected, then you may print it directly from the device. The first page, there will be patient information summary, and the same graphs displayed at the end of the test. And on the second page, all the numerical values measured, with the percentage compared to predicted normal, and if a pre-post test was performed, the percentage change between pre and post testing. And that's it. Now we've demonstrated how easy it is to use the Resmin Pro.